you know, we just reached one of our milestones. Um, no one knew before the game, like players-wise. Um, you know, we never talked about it, but to, to do something like that, you know, it's been a long time coming for the Laker Nation. And, um, you know, we just go out there and just try to play. Um, you know, we want, we're trying to be the best version of you know, the team that we can be. And, you know, like I said, it just, it's, it's a good feeling, you know. Obviously, we're not done. We still got a long way to go, but um, it's a good accomplishment for our organization. Hey, it's such a different game today that Utah wasn't bringing that fast double like Toronto was. Did, did you have a mindset to be more aggressive, or is that just what the game presented? Uh, coach just told me to be more aggressive. Um, you know, he felt like, and I felt like, too, that I just kind of played into Toronto's defense. Um, you know, accepting the double team, and, and I, you know, I was making the right plays, but I still had to be aggressive at the same time, man. Um, you know, I just tried to come out you know, very aggressive tonight and, you know, still make them same, you know, smart plays, find the guys in the corner and the open guy, um, and just put pressure on the defense. Anthony, it's Dave. Now that you guys uh, were able to take the game Saturday and, and obviously make some improvements to your flow and fluidity, do you feel like with this point until the remainder of the season games are over, you can just kind of add building blocks to things you need to work on as you head towards the postseason? Yeah, for sure. I mean, we still want to go out and win every game, but, um, you know, we want to sharpen our tools as well. So, uh, you know, coach might try lineups or, you know, different schemes or whatever just to work on it. But um, we're still going to come out and, and, you know, play Lakers basketball. You know, nothing's going to change because we clinched. Uh, we still want to come out and, and do the things that we do on both ends of the floor. Hey, Anthony, it's Bill Lorem with The Athletic. I'm wondering, did uh, over, over the last couple of days since that the last game, I mean, obviously a lot was made about your assertiveness against against the Raptors. Did that game bother with you? Did it sit poorly with you? Did you feel a certain desire to go out and kind of remedy what had happened in, in that outing? Yeah, for sure. I mean, uh, you know, I have to – Play better basketball than I did to, to help the team win, and you know, even though I was making the right plays, I still had to be aggressive. You know, I, I didn't like the way you know I performed, and um, the, we didn't like the way we performed as, as a team. Um, so it was a it was a collective effort to come out and just be more aggressive. You know, shoot and shoot the ball. You know, we shot poor last game, but we want to come out and, and just keep shooting. You know, knowing that we're going to find our rhythm, and I think everybody was more aggressive tonight. Um, you know, hence why we got the win. We, we played a lot better. Uh, I mean, it's pretty easy for me. You know, I just try to come out the gates, you know, very aggressive, and the team kind of follows. Um, you know, Brian kind of does a great job of making sure that I get aggressive by throwing me the ball, you know, telling me to go. Um, you know, but I think as a team, we came out very aggressive tonight, you know, even though we. You know, we, we started off slow. I think they was up 5 nothing or something like that. We missed a couple shots, but, you know, God wasn't hesitating to shoot. Um, God was driving to the basket, getting fouls, you know, finishing at the rim. So, um, you know, I just tried to come out, you know, very aggressive and just kind of lead the pack. And, you know, the rest of the guys did the same thing. Kyle Good. Um, you know, it's not so much about the individual matchups, but obviously the Bill Bears and all of the A's and Caliber Center. You guys are discussed a lot as candidates for defensive player of the year. How does that influence either your motivation or energy? Um, it doesn't. Um, obviously, he's a great defensive player. Um, I was pretty upset that he got me the first time, the block in the first quarter. So um, just try to you know, get into his body and finish. But um, there's no extra motivation. The motivation for me is to win a basketball game, do what I can to help the team win. Um, and that's all I try to do tonight. Hey, it's uh, Dan White here with the LA Times. Uh, you guys have played six games if you count the scrimmages to this point. Ha has the level of play in Orlando been to your expectations? Have guys been maybe less rusty than you'd expect, or has it been kind of what you thought it would be? Um, I think, you know, guys are ahead of the curve. Even the first game when we played uh, Dallas, you know, we talked about that, you know, guys on both teams were ahead of the curve, you know, Guys weren't as rusty, and uh, you can tell that guys been working, you know, during the hiatus. But um, I think the level of competition has been been amazing um, for for every team that we play so far. You know, guys are, are you know bringing you know and, and leaving everything on the floor. So um, it's been good. It's been good for us. You know, giving us a test to see where we are, and um, you know we just.
just got to make sure that we just keep working. Okay, last two questions. Kyle Goose. Do you home quarterback? Do you have to make that decision with your quarterback when you have to make that decision? Yeah, that's a good question. That was the first question. No. Um, I mean, like I say, it's definitely an honor. The organization, you know, um, haven't made the playoffs in a long time. And so uh, for us to, to clinch and, you know, solidify our playoff spot um, means a lot to our team, means a lot to our organization. And uh, like I say, it's, it's a small a small milestone uh, of what we're trying to accomplish. So uh, we still have a long way to go, but, you know, we're definitely going to enjoy it. Um, are you going to – the race for the eight seed is pretty interesting. You know, Nah, um, I heard they had a good game tonight, you know, but it doesn't matter to me, you know. Um, whoever we're going to see in the HD, we're going to obviously respect them and uh, try to go out and, and win that series.